Hey everybody, welcome back. Welcome to Something Old, Something New Car Rips. I'm Lance, and today is Monday, and I was waiting for the mail to see if one of my subscription boxes came in, and it didn't, so for our Monday Mystery Box, we're just going to have something I put together myself. It's going to have like $100 in packs, roughly. I did get one of those packs from my LCS. These $5 packs will be like our guaranteed head. They should have an auto or a mem card in here. They're $5, like little grab bags, and a bunch of packs. Let's see what we can get out of here and see what we can do, how I did putting it together. So I got some 2021 opening day, some Donruss, these are all hobby packs, archives, 2020 Tops UK, really like that design, 2016 Optic, 2020 Tops Heritage, 2021 Tops, 2020 Allen Ginter Chrome, Chronicles, and a jumbo of 2021 or 2020 Top Series 2. So Lots of different stuff in here. I pretty much value this like about a hundred bucks. Ten, five, five, five fish. This is like eight, nine, five ish. Or this is like seven, six. This is like two dollar fifty. This has gone up in price, so it's really hard to put. Especially same thing with this Chronicles all over the map for the last six months. Came out pretty low and then it got high, and then it got low, and now it's high again. So and then these are about mid twenties. Maybe about 25 for that when I bought it. It's a little bit more than that now. So roughly, we'll just call it 100 bucks. So we'll go ahead and get started with this 2016 Optic. Some of this stuff is out of hobby boxes too. I already have. So like, I already know I don't can't get the uh, autograph out of this Optic pack. I already got to pull two autos out of here the box. But we see if we get one of those rookie cards. Robson Cano, Jose Bautista, and that's not the rookie I was looking for. Brandon Drury, and a Prince Fielder. So. Did not get who we were looking for. I was talking about Trevor Story, Trey Turner, or Corey Seager. Moving on to this 2020 Topps Chrome, Alan Ginter. So we get a cool mini for the daughter. There's a Clayton Kershaw. And we did get a bugging out Alice Moth. Not sure if she has that one already or not. And a Zach Wheeler, so. Nothing to show for it so far. Moving on to this 2021 Tops Heritage. Did buy this from the LCS out of a fresh box. So we got see what we can get. There's a Mike Trout on the top. I'll always put a Mike Trout up up top. There's a Cabrian Hayes. That's a good one. Kessinura. Matt Chapman in action. Didi Gregorius. So not much there. That's a high number short print. Nothing else besides that, though. The French Tech's backs are kind of cool looking. They're not yellow backs like they have been, and uh, a little bit harder to see. Moving on to 2020 Tops Heritage. Just looking for some of those big rookies. There's a Xander Bogarts. There's a Kyle Lewis. So definitely getting some rookie cards out of here. Not much besides that, though. Nothing there in the back of those guys. You know, those Tops UK. Hoping to get one of those parallels, big Ben parallels. And we got one of the UK icons. It's the only insert in there, the UK icons. Who did we get? Princess Diana. She's worth a top five right now. So it's basically the same design. Just has a little UK flag in the top. The parallels are really sweet looking. There's a Trevor Story for the PC. Brendan McKay rookie card and a Sean Murphy rookie card. So, did get a couple rookies out of there. Nothing you just see. This is like uh, kind of like Tops Chrome. It's where the Series 1 and Series 2. So, you got all the rookies to pick from them out of there. Moving on to 2020 Tops Archives. Hoping to get a nice parallel. Really like the parallel colors in here. Brandon Woodruff, Marcus Stroman. There's an Aaron Hicks, Rafael. Glacius, Bruce Roll, Gratterall, John Lester. So we got one, two, four packs left. Moving on to 2021 Baseball Donruss. Let's see if we can get another nice rookie out of here. There's a Noah Syndergaard. There's a Nolan Ryan. Hebert Ruiz. There's a Yaz. Mike Calhoun and Dustin May. It's nice when the Dodgers in blue like that, but... 
Definitely not much out of that pack. Moving on this 21, 2021 opening day. Hoping to get one of those rare inserts. Dugout Peaks, Walk This Way, Opening Door, Opening Day Origins. You can pull autos. This definitely isn't fat, uh, thick enough to be a, have a relic in it. it. Looks like we got a mascot card. There's a Francisco Lindor. Corey Seager. Whit Merrifield. And there's the mascot for the A's. Moving on to our last two packs. We get this Chronicles. So this is also out of Hobby Box. There is two packs left, and there's one auto left. So this has a basically a 50% chance. And that's not any higher or lower. I mean, actually, that's kind of lower because there's four hits in the box and six packs per box. So you get packed and or hit in every one and a half pack. So there's a Trey Turner Limited, Chris Bryant. There's a big old Spectra Mike Clevenger. Some kind of parallel. Numbered out of 68. Put that up there, I guess, for now. We get certified Nolan Ron. Nope. Oh, there's a Luis Robert Green parallel. That's a nice one. Now the titanium. Got to put that up there. We'll put that in front of Mike Clevenger. There's an AJ Puck Mosaic. Mosaic's a really nice card. And the Crusade. Brendan McKay. I really like Crusade. I like Crusade, the Titan. Mosaic, the Phoenix. I really like the Phoenix out of there. Our last pack, besides the uh, grab bag. So, Jumbo Hobby Pack of Tops. Doesn't look like we got the hit. If we did, it's an auto. There's a Willie Calhoun. Bending up. It's a big, big pack. There's a Willie Castro. Take a Willie Castro. Noah Syndergaard. TJ Zook. Mike Miner. There's a Will Smith Gold Cup. Michael Kopeck. Josh Donaldson. Hopefully you guys' teams are doing well and everyone had a great Easter weekend and a great spring break. Tom Heschelman, Keon Wong, didn't really do much. There's our Lewis Robert, tops now. And there's a gold foil of Wilson Ramos. There's a player of the decade, Mike Trout. Another nice Mike Trout. A Johnny Bench and a Vladdy. Tops 20, 30 cards, so. Did not get any hits out of all those packs. Let's hope our guaranteed hits not too bad. They're usually these aren't uh, usually very great. But who knows? I don't know exactly what he puts in here. So far, I haven't got anything that's worth writing home about. But I really like some of the cards that are on the edges. So like this Nolan Ryan, Shohei Otani. He's starting out good. So that's a nice card. And this Future Stars Noah Syndergaard. That's the reason I bought the card. It's got two two guys on it already. Two guys for the PC, J.D. Drew. Jesus Flores and Brad Sam. There's some 87 Donruss. Kind of nice to see since we have the 87 design in this year's Donruss. Looks a lot better with black borders, doesn't it? <laughs> Did not know what they were thinking with those white borders. But, oh, we got an autograph out of there. So, we get something at least. But we got Cyanel, Cyanel Perez out of... 45 out of 75 out of last year's uh, prism. Some definitely a prospect, probably. Never heard of him. Someone have to let me know how he's doing. We'll just put it down here for now. There's a Boog Powell. Some 2021 tops. Tops Chrome. There's a Nico Horner rookie card de rookie debut out of update. He has a better season this year. There's a Steven Gonzalez red. Not numbered. And a JD Martinez. So there you go. I'm going to go ahead and stick with those in my top five. Let me know what you think. Like I said, I just put this together myself. So it's not like I bought it from somebody or some of the packs I already have because I had boxes. Some of the packs I picked up at the LCS. It's kind of convenient having two LCSs close to me. As always, thanks for watching, everybody. Have a great start to the rest of your week, and I'll see you next time.